Hello, friends and family. All right, so I'm doing my morning run, and I'm thinking about this movie we just watched recently called The Hate You Give. Might have heard of it. Heard of it? Came out in 2018, and uh, it was really good. I mean, I, I liked it a lot. We seem to enjoy it. Uh, a lot of takeaways. First of all, um, they did a lot of things in the movie right, which is to say, there was a main protagonist. Um, it involved around some like <clears throat> true events inspired by a book that was inspired by true events and um, <clears throat> it really had it was a vantage point type movie it had the different aspects of different members and how they reacted to the same situation and they reacted really differently from each other based on uh, themselves their own viewpoints and preferences and uh, under the surface it was kind of a make you think type movie, which a lot of them are for me anyway, but um, this one, it, it's kind of a reminder that no matter, like there's a difference, there's a huge difference between the world you live in and the world around you. So let me explain. The world you live in is kind of like uh, how it affects you yourself and a lot of things matter like location and uh, who, how much money people make and how they choose to manage that money and family background and stuff and um, I think that if just because you have a neighbor or a family member or someone that you feel is close to you in some way it doesn't mean that they're living in the same world that you are so they are in the world around you but they're not in the world that you live in if that makes any sense um, in this story, um, something really tragic happens to uh, basically an innocent person and it really transforms them into a different person, which confirms what I've heard for a long time and I've, I've always believed that we are all like two steps away from our life drastically changing in any different direction, for the better, for the worse. Um, and the circumstances that we put ourselves in aren't always the circumstances that we, we choose to be in. Um, a certain amount of them are, but um, certain things just kind of happen, you know, such as the village you were born into, you know. Um, well, yeah, it was uh, like I, I recognized some of the actors and stuff. And so that was a blessing and a curse because, number one, uh, sometimes I just see the actor instead of the character, but, um, number two, it was, when, when I really forgot about who the actor was and I was focused on the character, it reminded me at how, how skillful they were at acting. So that was really cool. Um, but yeah, it was a, a really nice, uh, a really nice way to spend the time watching that movie. Um, so, again, I feel like I'm very lenient on some of my movie reviews but I, well actually I pro if it sucked I probably wouldn't even be talking about it but yeah since I am talking about it I would say uh, it's not a bad one to check out there is some kind of cheesiness to it and some predictability to it that is kind of necessary for the overall arc but um, I would say all in all um, it's it's a uh, I'm glad I watched it and not just because it was entertaining, but also because uh, it made me think a little bit. Um, yeah, I guess that's it.